Welcome my brothers and sisters to my channel today and thank you all. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you to all the subscribers, all the new subscribers. If you're new to me, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button and hit that like button. That lets others know that my messages definitely help you. I got a great message from the Universal God as always on this beautiful Saturday. It's about, uh, what is it, like 7 a.m., early dawn. I'm always up off the early morning. I feel great because I'm at peace. Despite what's going on in the world, I have such great peace because I choose my the spiritual being over the human. Most men teach you as the human, but you are a spiritual being. You come from the creator, the universe of God, and you are merely consciousness which is inside your subconscious brain and that's what man is battling for since you've been born your subconscious brain all through the power of lucifer trying to hide your true identity from you but uh man god universal god is great Today's topic, guys, Great Awakening 2020, October 10th, 2020 is finally here, a week to remember is coming, but time to rejoice. Guys, if you can read Philippians 4.4, the Lord says, Rejoice always and say it again, rejoice. So that's what I'm going to do today because now October, this is the uh, the Mickey clock has struck 10, 10 and this is the day we, this is the week we all been waiting for. Whether it's a uh, blackout coming, but uh, whether it's not, we know a lot of information is going to be unveiled. As the White Hats said it. Another thing, guys, I have to bring to you. You know that the uh, the media and also the enemies of us also read those, uh, those listings. I have to be careful how I word, word things because they are uh, on YouTube. They, uh, they decode words and they try to take you off. So I have to. I have to dance around with coding of certain words. Certain words I cannot say. I have to kind of dance around them. That's why. But uh, out the enemies that we that that are of the world also see these uh, crumbs that's being dropped. So it's a panic in D.C. going on right now. So imagine if you know you've you've done treason. And you're seeing these drops, but you don't know the day or the time of that. That's the main thing. Us, we also need to be more patient. Think about it. These corrupt people been in power for thousands and thousands of years. So what's one year of your life to have the rest of your life is all good. So be patient. There's been some people. I've only been at this since March. There's been some people 15 years that's been known these secrets of the dark side of the of our country, of the world. So get in line, man. We have to be patient. Everything is getting unveiled. It's just not when we want, but man, just enjoy and rejoice. Every time the universal guy is showing us stuff, just rejoice. The Michigan governor, there was an attempted kidnapping, but there's spyware all over that we can't see. So it got foiled in your media. Yeah, I tuned in to MSNBC to take a peep. They still promoting that quote unquote virus, which I just told you there is no virus, only if you believe in it. So Let's see. So, guys, when when we go to the 
a lot of people are going to have a lot of trouble with the fifth dimension. They've been warned not to watch media and they still watching. And also they not doing the commandments of God. As I told you yesterday, when you when you don't do one commandment, it's the same as not doing all of them. There is no more partial doing the law of God, the word of God. You have to either be all in or not in. A lot of our family member friends, they tried, they could get by with the third dimension, with the partial, like, oh, okay, I can do that. You can't do that anymore. It's either all in for God or not in at all. They've been for like uh, cancer, I told you. It, outside left out the meats. It says in Exodus and Leviticus, especially pork. Pork is one of the most forbidden animals, but you should not be eating meats. Meats has cancer. You can simply do a research on that too. And then you take on the DNA of the animal. So if you don't have, if you don't have a higher frequency to the, you're going to struggle. Because the universal God is allowing the people that not fully in, he's, he's letting them be of the world. So they also panicking. Because the real information we're waiting for has not dropped yet, but things also has been declassified, like Hillary Clinton's emails. And uh, the FBI getting exposed. Meaning they're not, they, they were always corrupt, but you're start you're seeing the people who don't believe. This is for them. We already know. So it's, it's a big story. Just trust the plan. Like the president, Donald Trump said, we have it all. They be telling you. <laughs> but they got to do things where people, could, a lot of people have not woken. So. I'm going to sit back and enjoy this whole week and see what's unveiled. Also, uh, we're seeing that China is assisting with the Black Lives Matter movements and also Antifa. All that's getting unveiled slowly but surely. A lot of the stuff we know, but the public is it, coming, man. But this week, the clock has struck struck uh, October 10th, 2020. This is supposed to be the start of some great things coming. Spying on campaigns. Perhaps Obamagate. We'll see what comes. I'm not making promises, but the, this week has been promised a while. Uh, it's going to be some big things coming this week. For us, it's nothing to fear. You should be every day rejoicing because you believed in the truth from the universe of God. He sent people like me and yourselves to form one people, but they, they wouldn't listen. So some people seeing is believing, so they're going to have a harsh reality coming. But uh, man, I'm going to rejoice, rejoice, rejoice. Philippians 4.4. 4. Rejoice in the Lord and always. And that's what I'm going to do. That's my message to you from the universe of God. So sit back and grab your popcorn. Enjoy the movie that's uh, partaking. And you'll be just fine. Bye-bye. Take care.